No, I I do feel like I acted um, emotionally. I agree. I regret what I've done. No. Do I want to apologize? No. I think you should. Okay, this one actually let me be absolutely flabbergasted myself. Welcome back, my delinquents. So we're back on copycat VTuber news or copycat artist news, I suppose, with a little bit of, I guess, dumb thrown in. And if you haven't heard about it, popular VTuber Powder accused another VTuber of stealing their design and chaos unleashed. And I would like to call this another hilarious situation. Hilarious in the sense that this escalated to such levels when it was absolutely completely avoidable. And that's, as you know, when it becomes hilarious is when all of this was so avoidable. So let's get into the story so you can understand why in a way it's hilarious. Powder kind of dug in on this for no particular reason, but why this is also dangerous to do. But you can easily incite a lot of hate or harassment when you do things like this. And that is the dark side of even something that is stupidly hilarious is sometimes people get hurt even if you don't mean it. So let's get into it. I find these kind of stories really hilarious, but a lot of people call me insensitive. If so, I'm sorry. It just sometimes with the complete dumbassery going around along with some of these where it could have been completely solved with my bad at the beginning is silly. And I have met Patter a couple times, not the person this was bad. Lily, uh, didn't deserve this. I'll let you all make a decision yourself on this, but I don't think there's enough similarities other than the color schemes. For me as an artist, even layering them up, I don't think there's even close to tracing and I don't think much is even inspired may as well a friend if that makes sense that's just from my perspective so we're gonna start with what set this off powder made this clip about someone copying them they had made some alluded little st statements about it going oh I feel bad about this etc not much to think about and they said they were gonna say anything about it because it just gives them attention and my opinion is on that that is true. Most of the time copycats just get attention, even if they're 100% copying. I think it's just better to ignore them because if they are copying you, they're hoping to suckle clout from the main source. So same with the why I avoided the small Lola situation for so long is because I didn't feel like giving more clout to the situation because if she was copying, I'm just doing exactly what she wanted me to do, but it got out of hand, so I reported on it. The end, but let's do this video. How does this- I just realized I was gonna ha- I'm gonna have to censor that because it's copyrighted music. Damn it all. But yes, there was music there. Well, most of it. And if you've heard the mean, there it is. This is their design, pretty much, that Powder is saying is similar to their own. Vague idea of what Powder looks like right here. There, and their little cocaine puff. And flippy hair horns and stuff like that. And... As you can see here, they have horns, but completely different hair. Maybe it's like a silver purple, but I would say one's more white and one's more purple light, if that makes sense. They're different tones under there, and I would say their faces are different, and they have different outfits. Most completely, other than some color schemes and the horns, which a lot of people pointed out, bajillion anime characters that have similar horns. So, in my opinion, I don't think there's many similarities. Not seeing a lot. I'm not a little bit at the top, but honestly, that design is very popular. Little crescent in the middle out to show the cleavage. It's very popular. Demons are very run in the mill or demo, as they like to say. Again, very not that crazy. I'm not going to say it's not a very super original digital idea. Same with these ears. They have been around for a very, very long time. And differences in elves, this, anyone who's played Jack and Daxter knows these ears are a lot of games around that period. So uh, I'm not seeing a lot, honestly, other than the color palette and the horns. And they're both elves. That is it for me. Maybe there's something I'm not seeing, but I wouldn't even mostly pick up that they're powder. <laughs> Maybe they're a bit inspired by powder, but it's not much in my opinion. For me, I think they look distinguishable enough when I look at Lily I don't particularly see powder even with the horns and that's difficult when you're all the same if you're the same animal or creature to get that distinction and especially seeing they share colors so I think they get a, did a good enough job making themselves distinguishable so 
let's go to the response that Powder got to this. I don't think they got super positive responses to begin with, but a lot of people went into this. Mother- <laughs> Another girl likes the same basic colors and elves to cry. <laughs> elves are considered the basic bitch of the a anime fantasy or anything. So I'm gonna be honest, if you're an elf, it's a bit of a basic bitch character. d d fans are with me on this. <laughs> I say as a fucking bunny girl. God. Well, I throw in rocks in a glass house. <laughs> so I'm a copper too, literally. Apparently she tagged both of them. I didn't see this. Cheru and Lila VT, this is for you. And that's a bit rude as fuck as they bring the artist into this too. I think it's a bit rude to bring the artist into it. They only drew it. They j they go by what's requested by the person. I like your big balls. Come out and speak your mind. I would like to believe from all the silent support and DMs I've been receiving that YouTube is an artist moving forward if there is a threat of a lookalike that they would take the precaution to try and differentiate themselves a bit more. I don't know. I like, have to have some leeway with this because nothing is 100% original. I do think it's good to keep in mind where your limit is, but just because it's your limit doesn't mean it's acceptable to enforce onto other people when this is their design. Personally, I think you have to keep st stricter lines than your own personal beliefs. You may be uncomfortable, but that doesn't make you right, <laughs> if that makes sense. Honestly, there is reason there are strict lines with the lore on this. The lore, guys. But there is a lot of laws or just <laughs> standards. There's a lot of standards. No tracing, no stealing IP, etc. Like that. But I personally don't think that was crossed here just because many things are very different between these designs. For me. I think being neutral is pretty fair here because you can't really know Lily's full intentions here. We're going to go over the dock here. I don't personally think there's enough in there, but we're going to look at it. Powder definitely goes a little too far, I think, for something. And I, <laughs> I'm leaving here. Good, no worries. That doesn't age well. But I'm going to say here, because Powder goes on to have an interview with Alaria on stream. And I'm going to say here, I love Alaria, but people who go on her stream to do interviews when they're in drama just make their asses look so much worse so far. We're two for two. We're two for two right now. <laughs> it's not looking great. <laughs> and Alaria is so nice about it. Oh, Alaria. Everyone's always on my ass with me, how I'm saying it funny. I, can't, I try my best. I'm going to say it like a Targaryen. Alaria. <laughs> okay. Roll the so R. But continuing on ADHD, into this, because we have a doc out. from but Powder that they set up here. This get was really boring. This was nine this is pages only of documents. Honestly, Lily and they Powder dropped showed a, very similar a things. Dog, but give me a this is such a light drama. My I don't want to go eyes. through it all for a few. Oh, it God. takes her like seven minutes to eight minutes to go all through this. And I'm just going to give you the breakdown of what kind of happened. Powder reached out to the artist about the model. And they discussed being able to change things and they wanted to see DMs uh, to see if the person asked about them. Under the guise Powder wanting a commission from this person that I don't think they actually ever got a commission through them. And the artist gave them the DMs when they probably shouldn't have. And nothing really incriminating was out there other than the mention of I don't want to look too much like Powder in the end. And then Lily in Lily's leaked document she shows the full context of this of where it was like at the end of the design process, they were saying, oh, I like all the changes and all this stuff, but I don't want to look like Powder. Fair. But Powder then goes through Cherry, who is the artist, trying to get these changes made or trying to like sniff out if they can make these changes. And in the end, Powder leaves it, I think. And then months later, then contacts Lily to then ask for changes. But Lily's already sent the avatar away. And... This seems to be mainly about the demon or daemon thing and Lily offers to just remove that completely and just be an elf and it's fine. They aren't super connected or attached to it. And Powder is not happy about this. They want them to drop the horns or drop the palette color too. And Lily kind of stands their ground about this because they don't think Powder's being a bit demanding and I would have to agree. Powder is kind of being demanding with this. Demanding that they change this or they're upset. But... Powder goes, uh, I mean, Lily goes, I will just remove Damon or whatever. And the difference here is Powder thinks it's because they're a program or something. It, Damon is a program term, but more it is used in fantasy or demons and stuff like that. And that's what Lily was using it for. And Powder seems to be really doubling down on that. So they try and remove that. Powder isn't 
completely happy. And then not long later, Powder blocks them, I think, because they're not happy that they didn't drop the ears or the color palette or something like that. And then while Powder has her blocked, Lily then adds Damon back because if you're going to be blocked anyway, most people are going to be like, well, I couldn't please her, which again is fair. So I do think Powder came in very hot here. They, Their first DM to Lily was pretty much kind of calling them a liar and that they didn't believe them, that they weren't trying to copy them, etc. And there's a lot of stuff like that in here, but it's both of them kind of showing that very similar DMs, except Lily's with a bit more context. And... Powder seemed to be really doubling down on the fact that her friends backed her up saying, that looks just like you, or I thought that looked like you. But I don't think that's really enough to go by here, and I do think they were being very demanding, asking someone that they don't even know, that hasn't even properly debuted, to change their avatar, and then just kind of like hating on, uh, hating on them, or critiquing them, and then blasting them on Twitter about it, just because they wouldn't cave into their demands when... I think they were asking too much. And that's pretty much the equivalence of what's in these in these documents. 90 pages to tell you that story. I may have missed a couple of pieces, but that's pretty much the gist. It's just like a lot of art talk of, can you change this please? Or, oh, I think you're a liar, etc, etc. Let's continue on this tale. I just wanted to abbreviate that instead of spending like eight minutes going over these. The end. Okay, this is, that's a different drama, but let's go into the story here of this. Let's go into the first one. Because there's two clips from this. And you're emotional, I didn't but unfortunately intend that's what harm happened. from other people. I intended harm from myself to them. Right. Um, yeah, but that's not what happened, girl. I understand. That's not what happened at all. I understand, but I'm, I'm trying to, like, get your advice in this. Should well, I... Like I, I would never really admit that I, I would never really like intend was... harm from me to somebody else. You know, like I don't I don't think well, that way. That's so and you were emotional, I didn't but unfortunately intend... that's what... As you can see here, Alari Alaria is a little fab flabber flabbergasted, just a tiny bit, by Powder's responses here that they attended intended harm from them when with these tweets hoping kinda like Look, like they would get shit for it, not harassment, but shit, I guess. But let's go into the other clip before I get my thoughts on this. Yeah, this person one, copied her. One of you're one not of... gonna change that much. You're not gonna change your mind in it. But yes, she does recognize that she acted a little uh, rashly, and mm -hmm. you know, uh, it, it acknowledges that. Is that fair? Is that good? I don't want to put uh, words in yes. your mouth, No, I I do feel like I acted um, emotionally. I agree. Do I regret what I've done? No. Um, am I currently still emotional about it? Yeah, probably. Um, do I want to apologize? No. Um, I think you should. I, but yeah, again, I appreciate um, that. You know, that's uh, that's something I, that's that's on you. Yeah. If you want to do that, that is up to right. you. Right. Change your mind. Okay, this one actually let me be absolutely flabbergasted myself. Like, um, do I regret what I do? No. Would I not do it again? No. Would I apologize? No. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just, it, it completely flabbergasted me that response after getting a ton of backlash and saying they were kind of out of pocket. They're like kind of stretching it a bit and like getting the person bullied and like and stuff like that it's just like no i would not think i did the wrong thing even though everyone's telling me i could be wrong i don't think so <laughs> you're so crazy why would any saying why would anyone saying this i know she's like she's in an emotionally bad place or something but honestly it takes two brain cells to tell this is not going to help your image it's going to make you look worse and in the very sense of at least being selfish and wanting yourself to look good you shouldn't say this <laughs> you shouldn't say this it look makes you look terrible that's all i'm gonna say 
think Powder needs to put down the microphone for a second, honestly, and the very sense that they're making themselves look terrible. It made you look worse than actually being a bit dramatic about it. Because everyone has their moments, everyone's a bit dramatic, everyone's a bit sensitive, but this puts you into kind of being an asshole. <laughs> and yet everything becomes... More and more of this is just bound to happen, you know what I mean? Like, it, it sucks, but... Yeah. I, I think you've- I think you've said your piece, I think- I, Yeah. I, I would- I, I, I would probably right. take down this snarky response, but, you know, I'm uh, not. But I appreciate yeah, the- Yeah, no, I understand. <laughs> that, that is your choice, girly. That is um, your choice. Um... And you have everything but kind. Again, Alaria is a stronger person than me. Because I've been like, huh? <laughs> what do you mean, huh? <laughs> like, I get that's that choice, but girl, girl, Alaria is just trying to help you here. They were like holding their hand through this, going, please, please, I'm trying to help you. Please. Alaria's <laughs> like, I'm trying to make you look like better, please. And they're just like, nope, nope. I don't know how they don't a liar doesn't rip their hair <laughs> in some of these situations. So after all this, um two days later after this, uh Powder makes another response. Okay, sorry I'm a freak. I'm not as well worded as most people on drama, so ignore if you don't care. This isn't about owning anything. This is about bigger account versus personal account. This is a question about creativity and lack therefore of. And I do think it's a bit mean. To be like, you just lack creativity and that, but okay. <laughs> this is a question about creativity and lack therefore of. This is a question about when do consequences start being too much? Okay. It's about being oblivious to the similarities and the possible consequences on how that makes someone feel. I do think you aren't responsible for everyone's feelings just because some similarities between you make you feel upset doesn't mean a complete stranger is responsible for your feelings on this, especially when the similarities aren't tons. An easily avoidable thing that went ignored when it could have been nipped in the butt early. Again, I don't really know what would have satisfied Patty here from what I read in the DMs. What did she exactly want? Did she want her to stop, just go back to being an elf? She can't be an elf demon. She can't have white hair. What would have solved this problem exactly? Palette change, demon change, everything? Like word change, law change? Even though their lore is different? I just didn't, I don't see much except unless she completely changed her completely. Everything about a design if Powder would have been happy. An easily avoidable thing that went ignored when it could have been nipped in the bud early. I cannot control what other people do about my feelings, but I'm going to react in a negative way when I've been ignored and lied to about a com compromise. To be fair, they Powder did go in pretty hot, calling them liars straight away, and then block them. So I don't know. I don't know if I would stick to a compromise with someone who just blocked me even though you agree to a compromise. I don't know. Like realistically, they don't know each other. And you don't have to interact with anyone in the space you don't want to. So it kind of just made it seem, may have seemed like Powder didn't want anything to do with them and they're just going to go ahead anyway. They're just a small creator. Who cares about small creators? A lot of creator, small creators are like that. Like, no one knows who I am, bro. If you believe it's okay to just look like each other, then, well, I don't really understand your mindset. As humans, we all kind of look exactly the same. <laughs> I don't know. A lot of anime characters look very similar. It's like she has similarities to Amelia, but with little changes, she looks completely different. That is how art works, in my opinion. I don't know. I don't really understand your mindset. I want to see creativity. I want to see uniqueness. That's up to you, but that's not everyone. As we can tell by what people like to watch in anime, not everyone wants everything to be completely unique. Sometimes everyone wants the same isekai protagonist ten times in a row. Just the people different. I don't want to. I don't want to push the narrative that it's okay for people to just be like everyone else. Look at the bigger picture and stop focusing on one emotionally driven decision I made. I think it's okay to criticize when you say or have all the information. It's not okay to constantly berate someone. I always try to keep it a hundred percent with you all. I don't want to hold to half ass an apology if I'm not feeling apologetic just to be and very emotionally charged crowd on Twitter. Thank you for to everyone who has reached out to me privately. I'm lucky to have you all. I do think it was very emotionally charged, not particularly based on logic here, or a rational idea of uniqueness, because they have made a different unique look, but technically anyone would say, if you go by unique things, some people would say, elves aren't unique, demons aren't unique, 
But when you change things around, they become different. So if you want to talk about differences and uniqueness and stuff, I 100% if you go around looking, you'll find some fictional character that looks a lot like Powder. There'll be fictional characters and everything that looks like every other character. That's how it works. I personally think Ink, there is just not enough similarities here to go by. Personally, I think this took a thousand years and there was a lot of added information here, which was pretty much added context, but I feel like you could have got the gist of it quite quickly from um, the design in general of just not being similar enough to really warrant this kind of outrage, in my opinion. But what do you guys think? What's your opinion? Because uh, personally, I, as an artist, I feel like I'm a bit jaded on these things and I've seen a lot of designs that I don't think there's enough here to really do this and I think Powder just kept doubling down, doubling down, doubling down on something that could have been easily uh, shake hands, walk away from it situation but I think they desperately seem to want to be right here even if people kept telling them they weren't. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, don't forget to like, sub, subscribe and all that stuff and I will see you next time. My delinquents and I'll try my best to cut this up so it's not so long but I'm not hopeful.